fact, you know, the promises that was made that uh, we're going to get some vehicles, you know, for, for people <laughs> who were into the use of uh, Pragya. I'm told that uh, some, you know, 100, and I printed out this, this thing this morning. Yes, yes, so we'll, so we'll, sh we'll share that shortly with our <coughs> listeners as to whether it's even enough and whether people can go in for it because the figures are there as well. Uh, George is also on the line with us this morning. Good morning, sir. Good morning, David. How are you? I am well, George. Good to have you. David, accidents have been happening. So should we ban transport? Do we have to ban transportation because uh, uh, lorries have been having accidents? Look at what happened these two or three days. How many people died? You see, we must initiate a law so that we regulate it for the utilization of this pragya because it, it is helping especially in the farming communities. They use it to transport their goods to the market. You see? So we cannot say because it has been having accidents, so we have to completely ban them. Look at these bus that ran into uh, uh, another parking car and then the people got bent. So do we have to ban the buses? So what's your point? Are you, are, you for the, uh -huh. are, you, are you in support of legalization and regulation? Yes, legalization and putting measures in place. And let the law work. But looking, but measure. looking at us as a nation, as a people, how 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 well do we do when it comes to you know regulating some of these things? Do you think we can do a good job and say, well, don't get onto the highway, and we will ensure that they don't get onto the highway and stuff like that? David, the problem also lies with our leaders. You see, they are also failing to think. We should be able to put measures in place to regulate all, put police on the street to check. You see, so that people will also get jobs. But, but if you say that we have to ban them because uh, because of accidents, accidents have been happening all over. I hear you. So you are Thank in support. You. Thanks uh, for joining us as well. Zero three two two zero eight three five nine six. Uh, let's go to Tano. So where we have Kojo on 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 the line now. Good morning, sir. Good morning, Dave. Yes, Kojo. Uh, Dave, in the status quo, are we? The, the, the Pragya and the Okada people, are they in the system or not? They're already in the system. They're already in the I system. Illegally, yeah. Yeah, whether illegally or informally <laughs> or whatever. They are in the system and they are working. Mm. And in, indeed, the, they are causing accidents and so on. Cars and the, you know, the mainstream transportation are also causing accidents. And we keep on reviewing to identify what is causing these accidents. Maybe they drink and drive. They don't rest. Then we, we we enforce laws to you know mitigate all these things that cause an accident. Why don't we do same for Pragya? We need to know what is making them cause accidents. But the argument, Kojo, sorry, Kojo. Yes, the small boys are in there. But the problem with many uh, Kojo has to do with the fact that the accidents relating to motor tricycles and motorbikes are now getting higher. And you heard Doctor, you know, uh, Aka say that it's multiplied by over two thousand uh, times. 2,000 times, uh, percent, 2,000 percent, sorry, 2,000 percent over the past, let's say, 10, 10, 10 years or so. So it's getting worse. That is what I'm saying. The same research that identified the increase mm. can identify the cause of these accidents. The same thing we do for cars and the mainstream transportation, that when we find the cause, mm. we try to make laws to mitigate it. Let's do the same. Okay. Those are the thoughts so of when Kujo. We do the same and, and, and then we realize that it is going up or down. Then we can think of either... No, quitting. But for now, it is creating job. For now, it is creating a peculiar service that cars cannot cannot offer. Mm. So I think we need to, uh, you know, legalize it and then no sensor is or regulate it well. Those are the thoughts of Kojo, who joined us from Tano. So thanks for joining us, Kojo. Um, zero three two two zero eight three five nine six. Um, Charles is on the line. Good morning. Yes, hello. Good morning, David. Hi, Charles. Uh, I'm, I'm good. Good. Bye. Good. Please, I wanted to say that. Uh, Okada and Abubu Yadi are in, and people are patronal. There is demand for that, like someone said earlier. So, what's creating this demand? It's because of our poor public transport system, yeah. just one way, yeah. uh, just the roads, and we don't have any alternatives. And we have so much traffic all the time. So, there is demand for it. That's why people are using it. But unfortunately, there is a downside to it. Uh, we have they are very risky. The people who drive most of the time are, are, are reckless, and so we are getting a lot of uh, morbidity and mortality from that one. So I think really to solve it, we have to look at it. We have to have alternative 
means of transport. We are complaining that the whites came to dominate us. But when they were around, they had alternatives for us. The trains were working. I went to Pristia, and the railway lines, the metal uh, have been left. <laughs> I don't even know whether railway uh, have even taken custody of what they have. And people are taking them away, and nobody even uh, cares about it. Uh, the, we actually have a, a ministry for uh, railways, but nothing has really been done. For my first place, some of the uh, infrastructure already there, but we are not really making use of it. So once there is still demand for it, it will still go on. I hear you. People think it know uh, they are risky, but until we make our leaders to follow, uh, not uh, using uh, motorcades and all those things and follow the traffic, I'm sure they would appreciate it and make sure... Uh, at least road users are also comfortable. They don't have to stay in traffic for two hours, three hours. Grateful, grateful. Charles, for joining us. I'm grateful. 03220